Good morning, Davis Month, and I'm Chief Master Sergeant James Lida, the 355th Wing Command Chief, with your morning update. This is 23 March. Welcome back from the weekend. Uh, I want to start by um, clarifying a comment that Colonel Jolly made on Thursday afternoon. Uh, he called out Colonel Kennerson for maybe talking to some folks a little too long at the commissary, and uh, that drew a little bit of concern from across the base. I want everyone to rest assured that uh, we all love Colonel Kennerson. He does a great job here. Uh, my biggest concern with Colonel Kennerson is, is that uh, he is a hugger, and right now he's having a really hard time. Um, so for those of you out there, rest assured, we love him. He loves us. We're taking care of him. He's taking care of his group. Um, and uh, well, he kind of does talk too much. But uh, for your morning update, um, we are in HP Con Bravo. Arizona has 157 confirmed cases. Pima County has 17, but fortunately, Davis Monthan still has zero cases. Uh, we are in a low risk, moderate community spread area, but thanks to you washing your hands, keeping some distance between yourselves, we've been able to keep DM COVID free so far. Um, we. Through this, uh, we've we've adjusted some of our facility hours across the base, and uh, the best place for you to get those uh, those new hours as they change is right here on the PA Facebook site, the website, or Twitter. Our PA team has done a, has done a fantastic job, but I but I will tell you though that the information that they push is only as good as your willingness to go and pull it. So I need you to get on the Facebook site, Twitter, or the website and get the most recent information from our PA team. Um, there's, been, uh, there's been a little bit of concern over the commissary prioritized hours. We're going to continue those uh, hours giving our, our mission essential and support personnel and their dependents priority for the first two hours in the morning first and the last two hours in the afternoon. Uh, we understand the concern. However, we've got to make sure that our airmen that are performing the mission have peace of mind and are able to focus on the mission knowing that, that them and their families have the things that, that they need at home. Uh, FAM camp has come up uh, two or three times in our in our questions. Uh, our FSS commander spent the entire weekend uh, out in the FAM camp. She held 10 town halls, and um, the biggest concern is flushing the FAM camp. I want everyone out there to know that flushing the FAM camp is an absolute last resort for us. However, we're, we're, we're trying to communicate on as many uh, fronts as possible so that everyone understands that you need to be prepared for any scenario that may come up. And, in that same vein, we know that there are a lot of folks that are seeing the things that other bases are doing, closing bases down, uh, mission essential, restricting the access to the base. Uh, DM has not gone to any of those measures yet. However, again, we need everyone prepared uh, for any scenario that may arise. Um, for our gyms, the Benco basketball court has been closed uh, to, to ensure that we don't have large gatherings of folks. Uh, both of our gyms, the Benco and the Hafner, will close every day from 1300 to 1500 for cleaning. However, it is everyone's responsibility to clean the equipment before you use it and clean it again after you use it. Only through these measures will DM be able to stay COVID free. We need you guys to clean the equipment before, clean the equipment after. Um, I wanna give a shout out to the med group. Uh, these guys have taken on a heavy lift across the base. Uh, manpower is down, but those uh, um, Colonel Parsons honey badgers continue to get the job done every day over at the clinic. Uh, and also a shout out to the Force Support Squadron. Uh, those guys every day are processing tons and tons of information from, from around the, the Air Force, all of the changes, all of the updates, and uh, somehow or another, uh, they're, they're, they're keeping us up to date with the most current information available. Um, lastly, I want to address Colonel Jolly's comment at the end of his video on Thursday. Apparently, I've been, uh, I've been accused of pandering for likes through trading toilet paper. And I wanna make sure that I don't know where that message came from, but what I'll ask each and every one of you to do is to reach down to that little thumb at the bottom below me there and click that little thumb whenever you're finished with this video. DM, you're doing very well. Please continue to take care of one another. Look after each other. Now go wash your hands, rescue and attack.